What is fanocracy? Customers who are satisfied can leave you at any time, and they won't tell anyone else about you. So, how can you build loyalty and more meaningful connections with your customers, turning them into passionate fans? In Fanocracy, Turning Fans into Customers and Customers into Fans, serial best selling author David Meerman Scott and his daughter Rayco Scott present a step by step framework for how to build fans for any business through dozens of examples and insights, including The Grateful Dead and Harry Potter, to Microsoft and Haggerty Insurance. Fanocracy is the future of business, building a company that develops meaningful human connections with its customers. Why is fanocracy important? The pendulum has swung too far in the direction of superficial online communications. How many hours do we spend feeling social on Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, often unaware that we are interacting with bots? People are starving for human connection. To the point that the real relationship companies build with their customers is often more important than the products and services they sell to them. One way to build your fandom. David, co author of Fanocracy, is a massive live music fan. One of the most powerful moments in hundreds of live shows he's attended is when St. Vincent came down from the stage to play a guitar solo right next to her biggest fans. That was by far the most commented moment of the entire three day festival, all because of a simple yet frequently overlooked dynamic physical proximity. Neuroscientists refer to the space more than 12 feet away from you as public distance. Between 4 and 12 feet is social distance, and describes interactions among acquaintances. Between 1 and 4 feet is personal distance, describing interactions among good friends. And closer than that is intimate distance, used for embracing, touching, or whispering. One way to create a fanocracy is getting in close proximity with your customers. Or a company may leverage our thirst for closer connections, like the RV industry when it launched its Go RVing campaign, highlighting how you can get close to friends while camping to share more meaningful experiences. The campaign was incredibly successful. And the number of RVs sold in the US grew from 200,000 in 2008 to more than 500,000 in 2017. To love things outside of work and share those passions enables you and your business to create meaningful connections with like minded people. And these deep connections lead not only to success in business, but at the same time, exposing yourself to people who share your interests leads to a happier life.